It's a paint tattoo. It's not real. I'm a fan of Foxhound way back, when guys like you and my uncle were in it. None of that gene therapy like there is today. You guys were real heroes. There are no heroes in war. All the heroes I know are either dead or in prison. One or the other. But Snake, you're a hero, aren't you? I'm just a guy who can only find meaning on the battlefield. There's no winning or losing for a mercenary. The only winners in war are the people. That's right. And you fight for the people. I've never fought for anyone but myself. I've got no purpose in life. No ultimate goal. Come on. It's only when I'm cheating death on the battlefield. The only time I feel truly alive. Seeing other people die makes you feel alive, huh? You can't stop loving war. Is it the same for all soldiers throughout history? Why didn't you contact me? <sighs> My Kodak was broken. Is that all? Shouldn't you just be happy we met up like this? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Anyway, how did you recognize me in disguise? Uh, I never forget a lady. So there's something you like about me, huh? Yeah, you've got a great butt. Butt? Oh, I see. First it's my eyes, now it's my butt. What's next? On the battlefield, you never think about what's next. Yeah, he has some pants on. So, Snake, how are the negotiations going? No progress. So it's all up to you, huh? Somebody's gotta stop them from launching a nuclear missile. There are two ways. Either we destroy Metal Gear, or... We override the detonation code. You got the card keys from Baker? Card keys? You mean this? Where are the others? There should be three keys. This is all I've got. Now, where could the other two be? I have no idea, but they must be somewhere. If we can't find them, we'll have no choice but to destroy Metal Gear. I heard that Metal Gear is in an underground maintenance base to the north of here. Take me too. I know this place better than you do. You'll just slow me down. You don't have enough battle experience. I won't slow you down, I promise. And what if you do? Then you can shoot me. I don't like to waste bullets. Got it. I'll be careful. Yeah, we will see how careful you, know, you get. I don't use makeup the way other women do. I hardly ever look at myself in the mirror. I've always despised that kind of woman. I've always dreamed of becoming a soldier. But I was wrong. That it background always, like man. My father. He was killed in action when I was younger. You wanted to follow in your father's footsteps? Not really. I thought that if I became a soldier, I could understand him better. And so, you became a soldier. I thought I was, until today. But now I understand. The truth is, I was just afraid of looking at myself. Afraid of having to make my own decisions in life. But I'm not going to lie to myself anymore. It's time I took a long, hard look at myself. I want to know who I am, what I'm capable of. I want to know why I've lived the way I've lived until now. I want to know... Take a good look. 
you won't be seeing mirrors for a while. There won't be any chances to wash your face, either. Yeah. This isn't a training exercise. Our lives are riding on this. There are no heroes or heroines. You lose, you die a dog's death. Yeah. Is that Famas functional? Unfortunately, it's out of ammo. Where'd you get that Desert Eagle? I found it in the armory. It's a 50 caliber Action Express. There was a SOCOM pistol too, but I chose this. Uh, so I got a leftover, huh? Isn't that gun a little big for a girl? Now you treat me like a woman? Come on, use my 45. Listen, I've used a gun like this since I was eight years old. I'm more comfortable with it than I am with a bra. If we're gonna go north, we'll have to go through the commander's room on this floor. The overland route is blocked by glaciers. The door to the commander's room is security level five. This card will open it. Just pull that out of her bra. It was inside the pocket of the uniform I was wearing. It looks like he must have been guarding someplace important. Okay, let's go. I know this place better than you. I'll be point man. Follow me. <laughs> That's just fucking creepy, dude. That guy's just hanging upside down. Just chilling in the girl's bathroom. What happened to the music? I'll keep a lookout. Make sure you're ready, okay? Ah, okay, here we go. Okay, you, you, you. Oh, shit, controller. There we go. Alright, you go. I'm gonna uh, go check these doors. Yes, I can. Patazinamin, vitamin, pediment, min, 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 min. <laughs> I can't open that yet. Let's make sure all my ammo is conveniently restored for the ass whooping that's going to commence in a matter of moments. Get that ration, cardboard box. All right, now we can go. So, what? work out much? What is it? How you doing? Uh. Come here often? You know, Alaska. Why are you staring at my? At your at, at your Bahama mamas? I I don't know. Let me uh get in this box. You know how creepy that is, like, I am Snake! And now you cannot leave, because I'm putting, putting circles around you! You're under my spell! <laughs> this is just silly. Well, let's get, get, get going. Let me come open this goddamn door.
<laughs> what the hell? Flash dance? Cats? Rent? Practicing? Okay. Let's go. Come on, Mr. Foxhound. The commander is waiting. I would have been standing like, what the f- okay? What's wrong with you? Oh, my ear is itching again. Oh, that's just creepy. Just like, look at her. It'd be cool if you can like, see him behind. You're looking at my package! Get, get, get your eyes off that! That's not for sale! Huh. <laughs> Must be the goods! Let's see, look at that, uh... Yeah, dude, I see where your mind is, you fucking nasty ass. You work for FedEx? Cause you just checking out my package something fierce. Still looking at it. Oh. So you like big winners, huh? <laughs> Come on, man. Just go on with the damn fight. All right. Okay. There. Happy? Shit. See him. Let's see, he's gonna give me that explanation. Snake. Meryl's not herself. Don't use your weapon. It's Psychomantis. He's controlling Meryl. That tune is his mind control music. Don't use your weapon. Try to knock her out. You sure? Because I really had like this really big, awesome idea to use like one of these, but oh, whatever you say, man. I'll just give her one to the face. Oh, bitch! Oh, fuck! Ooh! Oh, Lord! You see how- I don't remember- Whoa! <laughs> remember, like, in the first one, it, like, takes her a minute before she shoots you, and then if she shoots you, she only, like, pops you once, and then gives you about ten seconds, and then shoots again? She really tried to fucking kill me. Optic camouflage, huh? I hope that's not your only trick. You Let me see the day in the background. Now, I will show you why I am the most powerful practitioner of psychokinesis and telepathy in the world. No, there's no need for words, Snake. I am Psychomantis. 